phone probably does not make it very enjoyable for you guys. I'll try and hold it still. Uh, regulated industry. 
and we have been successful in other jurisdictions have seen how we do it in San Francisco. There is no reason why this federal government should come here and interfere with the rights not only of San Franciscans, but of Californians to decide for themselves what is legal. And the people of the state of California through Prop 15 made it very clear that we in California care about patients, that we care about giving patients a right to what they need, which is simply medication. So we are not going to let we are not going to let the federal government interfere with the rights of people in our city. And I speak not only as an elected official, I speak as an openly gay man who knows the very important role that medical cannabis has played in the LGBT community. The fight for the right to access to medicine came out of the struggle for civil rights for LGBT people. Following the AIDS crisis, we had gay men and women who unified and pushed for Prop 215 because we know that we're talking about human life. And that's what this is about. And we are on the right side of history because history is on the side of civil rights. This fight is not over. We are not going anywhere. Our government has to be accountable to us, and we are telling them what they're doing is wrong. And lastly, I want to say to President Obama, you got elected four years ago with a promise, with a promise, a promise to our community that you would do the right thing. George Bush, for eight years, can go without infringing upon the rights of these patients. Why is an Obama administration doing the complete opposite. We expect better, we deserve better, and if you want to get reelected, you better do the right thing for these patients. Thank you very much.